Today we are going to start male reproductive system. So, what are the constituents of male reproductive system? The primary reproductive organ or primary sex organ of male are a pair of testes. A pair of testes, which is a skin pouch called scrotum, which is present inside a pouch like structure called scrotum, suspended outside the body. This is the testis covered by or encased by the skin pouch known as scrotum and suspended outside the body below the abdominal cavity. What is its function? It helps in maintaining the temperature. Scrotum actually helps to maintain the temperature. Test is, it is below the body temperature, that is, it is temperature regulator. You can say it as temperature regulator. which is necessary for optimum production of sperm or male sex gamete. So, primary function of testis is to produce sperm or male sex gamete. Production of sperm. The process of production of sperm is known as spermatogenesis. In addition to that, it also helps to produce or secrete the hormone testosterone. And this particular hormone, male hormone, is responsible for developing certain sexual characteristics, certain secondary sexual characteristics of male. So, initially we have testis, which is the primary sex organ. There are two testes in our body, in the body of a male, surrounded by a pouch, skin pouch, suspended from the body below the abdominal cavity. and this is helped to produce the male sex gamete or sperm by the process of spermatogenesis and to produce testosterone that help to develop certain sexual characteristics of male. Now, from testis, sperm is produced and passes through the duct known as vas difference. This is the structure, tube-like structures carry sperm to the seminal vesicle or rather kinds, epididymis to the urethra for transporting sperm. This tube-like structure is known as vas difference. Now, we come to the next part of the reproductive system, which is seminal vesicle. Here is seminal vesicle. Seminal vesicle actually is the storage device of sperm. Secretion from seminal vesicle and prostate gland, here is the prostate gland, add up to make the semen. Now, then from there, it is through the urethra, the sperm coming through the urethra to the penis. Penis is the muscular organ, serves as genital urinary function that is help to allow both the urinary products that is the urine as well as the passage form and serve as the passage for sperm. The urethra works as a common passage for both urine as well as sperms. So, this is the basic structure of the male reproductive system. So, 
Now, what we have, first of all, we have testes. As we know, testes is responsible for production of male sex cells. Or sperms by the process known as spermatogenesis and to produce testosterone, the male hormone for developing the sexual characteristics. Then come to scrotum. What is scrotum then? This is the extension of abdominal cavity. which hold the testis and acts as temperature regulator for optimum production of sperm. Then we have already talked about vas difference. Vas different tube-like structure. Actually, this connects epididymis. to the urethra for transporting sperm to the urethra for transporting sperms. What is epididymis? The epididymis is the expanded tubule. which stores sperm help to give motility to sperm storage as well as give motility to sperm. Then in addition to that, there exist certain accessory glands. What are these accessory glands? The glands are seminal vesicle and the function of seminal vesicle is the secretion from seminal vesicle and prostate gland, both these two and prostate gland. Actually add up to male semen, produce to make semen and Another gland known as Cowper's gland. This Cowper's gland actually secretes mucus. 30% of the semen volume produced by these two. And Cowper's gland mucus secretion responsible for mucus secretion. And then we have, finally, we have penis through which the sperm released. Through which the sperm released. Then this is all about male reproductive system of human. So, male reproductive system basically. We have two basic division, male reproductive system. We have two basic division. One is primary sex organ and secondary sex organ. Primary sex organ is made up of a pair of testes and secondary sex organ we have accessory glands as we have already discussed accessory glands and penis so this is all about the male reproductive system of human thank you
for testing your understanding of this lesson and more videos log on to www.tubelessons.net